Hi there, welcome to this drum tutorial for Dakota by the Stereophonics. So this is part of the Andy Guitar Live Band program where we're learning 21 songs and getting you to play along with the live band so you feel what it's like to be in a band. The first pattern that we're going to play is the verse pattern which happens a lot in the song um, and it's on the hi-hat, closed hi-hat pattern. I'll show you, here we go. Okay, so very simple. We're doing two bass drums every time. One and two, three and one and, yeah. So it's two bass drums each time. Just try it a little bit slower for you. So here we go. Okay. The only thing, other thing that's happening in this is every eight bars, there's a little kind of turnaround section that is mirrored on the drums. Actually that, da, da, douche. So I'll just play that for you in context with the pattern. Just that. That happens every eight bars. So I'll do the full eight bars so you can hear that. So. So we're just doing on the on the hi hat and then crashing on the one. So that's the verse pattern. So let's try that with the track. Remember we've got a bit of a the intro at the start, eight bar intro, and then we're in. So let's try that with a live band. Here we go. Okay, so next section is the chorus. Now we're back to this kind of double time snare thing. It's not double time snare thing, that's kind of just what I call it, but we're, where we're doing the snares and all the quarter notes. Uh, now the, the bass drum in this part is a little bit tricky. We're doing bass drums on one and two, three and four. One and two, three and four. So let me just play it for you. Try it for a little bit slower, here we go. Now, what it does as well is it, it does four bars of this constant snare drum on the quarter notes and then four bars of the straighter groove. So it's good to practice that together. So I'll just play that for you, sort of around track speed, here we go. Okay, so just practice that and then we'll try that along with the live band now. So 
yeah, so the only other bit in this song is kind of the extended chorus kind of section um, where it gets really big at the end and we're we're still keeping this kind of like quarter note snare thing but we're on to a crash and the, the we're basically just filling in the bass drums in between so let me just play it for you so again okay so that's all of the quarter notes get and get and get and get just try that for you a little bit slower. There we go. Okay, so let's go for a full play through with the live band now. Here we go.
Okay, so I hope that was, I hope that went well. I hope you get all your bits in the right place. Um, and again, there's in the description, you've got all of the, the uh, chart of how many bars you need to play in each section, which, which helps a lot. So uh, have a look at that. And I hope you're enjoying these videos. Please check them all out. Like and subscribe. And uh, I'll see you in the next one.